What might you be excited to try in your classroom in the next week or month? Was there anything either that we had planned or that you got from talking with a colleague that you're excited about? You know, when someone uh, teaches what they call a special in elementary schools, um, they're the only one of their kind in the building. And it's really an isolating experience for them. So we got this wonderful experience, this one day a year, to bring these folks together and to give them a chance to interact with each other, doing that through their unique lens. So we had a really powerful day of learning and trying out very hands-on, interactive, different types of technologies. This is Ollie and Spiro, and they are robots that you control with an app, and you can also program Ollie using different code to tell Ollie how to move. 180 would turn around, right. And then I would go. Ooh, zigzag's cool. How do I flip? <laughs> Ooh, I like a flip. flip. You gotta flip. Oh, so when it's turning, that's part of how it's turning. Uh, yeah. So no, I think this one, let's have it go just like um, another 100. And then we also had experiences that were totally hands-on, where we set forth a challenge and they worked in groups to figure out how to meet it. Flip it for a while, that makes your motor run, and then turn it off and it'll launch up. We also looked at some other programs like Minecraft. You may want to say, show me what you learned about Colorado history in Minecraft. And utilize that to really try and save a city that's on the brink of pollution, disaster, or you know, going into a brand new environment and having to build an entire uh, city from the ground up. And building different costumes, so maybe they could be a Civil War reenactment or a Revolutionary War reenactment. And it's clearly very engaging. Just like you guys are so not listening to me right now, I love it. <laughs> You're in the zone and it's awesome. <laughs> We're going to look at SimCity EDU. It's free. So now what you'll do is you'll open a new tab. So click SimCity. You can go ahead and create your class. You'll have to create a student. So then if I, if I just hold down, see how I can tilt. Oh, got it. OK. So these are all the kids that have not gone to school. <laughs> so Because they can't get there. Right. So you would place your bus stops gotcha. near these big populated areas. This is a great group of people. They're incredibly smart and dedicated and they found ways to change, modify, uh, make things better than what we had even dreamed would be possible. It was a pleasure to be with these people and to see them engaging with the same level of, of joy and enthusiasm and laughter that we want to see in our classes every day.